What's going on, moviegoers? If you're new to the channel, my name is Christian. Welcome to SeaWorld Productions. Scream 6, you guys. Now, this was a film I'm not particularly excited for ever since I found out that Nev Campbell will not be returning to the role of Sidney Prescott. And it has gotten so much backlash. So much backlash between the fandom and now people are just in utter disgust with the studio because they didn't want to give Nev the money that she deserves for being the face of the franchise since 1996. The disrespect is real. But coming with some new reports, you guys, apparently Nev has signed on for a small role in Scream 6, but that's not the catch. She will have a much bigger role in Scream 7. How interesting is that? Now, no, you, look, you know the studio's like, look, okay, we're sorry. We apologize for this whole Nev Campbell debacle. And we understand, we understand the frustration within the fandom. And we get it. So we want to make things right. Okay, Nev. Looks like we're using this part of the script or this, you know, our different, a different version of the script since you declined the offer originally, right? And we've already started shooting. We can't stop what we've shot. So why don't we just have you in for a small portion of this film, but come for Scream 7, we want you to be the main character for Scream 7 to close out this franchise, hopefully. <laughs> I think it's, it's kind of crazy that, you know, this kind of confirms we are getting another Scream after Scream 6. That's crazy. Seven Scream movies, you guys. Seven Scream movies. Hasn't been rebooted. It's all been a part of one whole timeline evolving around Sydney Prescott. Don't know how much her character is going to be that involved with the story for Scream 6 since Scream 6 takes place in New York City. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Didn't Sydney and her family live in New York City? Very interesting. Now, now I'm, I'm, a, I'm a little intrigued by it. Well, it's, it's kind of weird knowing that. You know, that this, this film is not going to take place in Woodsboro. Now, granted, Scream 2 didn't take place in Woodsboro. You know, it took place in whatever college they were at. But, you know, it makes me that much more happier for fans, the franchise, you know, that the studio recognizes they're wrong, you know. And, you know, they, they realize not having Nev Campbell a part of the franchise is extremely blasphemous. It, it, it is. And, you know, she's had so much support from the fans. She's had so much support from... Her, her co-stars of, you know, the original Scream, you know, uh, I think, what's his name? Matthew Lillard and, um, oh my God, I'm forgetting his name, Jamie Kennedy, all, you know, voicing their opinions and their support for, you know, their former co-star, you know, Nev Campbell. And I love it. I love when they all come together because they all go to Comic-Cons, not Comic-Cons, yeah, it's Comic-Cons, like these, these fan events or whatever. And, you know, they have this whole Scream thing. And it's it's, fa it's it's fantastic to see, honestly. And I love the fact that they're coming to the support of Nev Campbell because she definitely deserves all the money in the world being the face of this franchise for damn near fucking 20-something years. It's, it's ridiculous when you think about it, you know, that the fact that all seven of these movies are going to take place in the same timeline it hasn't been rebooted i mean nightmare on m street yeah well yeah they rebooted that in 2010 friday the 13th they rebooted multiple times jason's been in space halloween's had plenty of reboots different timelines different stories and stuff like that but man kudos kudos to nev campbell i'm really happy I'm, I'm really happy and i'm waiting for this to be officially announced hopefully sometime soon you know, so everybody can get excited about it. But post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think about Nev signing on to Scream 6 for a small role, but for Scream 7 having a much bigger role. Thoughts and opinions, you guys. What do you guys think? Do you think Nev deserves everything in the world from the studio? I personally do because being the face of a franchise like Scream for 20-something years, you got to pay your respects. But post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. Peace.